Let's talk about perimenopause. That confusing stage that every woman will experience if she lives long enough. Here's the science behind it. We are born with all the eggs we will ever have, around 1 to 2 million at birth. By the age of 30, we have already used up about 90% of them and by 40, only a small fraction that is maybe about 3% remain. Each month, thousands of eggs fade naturally as a part of the body's normal process even though only one is released during ovulation. When this number of healthy eggs gets very low, the ovaries stop responding properly to the brain's hormonal messages, the ones that say it is time to ovulate. So the brain keeps sending stronger signals trying to push the ovaries to work, but they are starting to resist. And that is when the cycles become unpredictable. The hormone levels rise and fall erratically. Estrogen might surge one week and crash the next. Progesterone may not rise as it used to. You might notice mood swings, fatigue, poor sleep, heavier or missed periods, brain fog, even anxiety or palpitations. This is perimenopause, the transition zone between regular cycles and menopause. It is not that your body is breaking down. It is kind of recalibrating. Your brain and ovaries are renegotiating that relationship after decades of working in perfect rhythm. And here is something important. There is no single blood test that can confirm perimenopause. Hormone levels fluctuate too rapidly for that. So the best diagnosis comes from your symptoms, your age and your story and not just a lab number. So if your periods are irregular, your sleep feels off or you just don't feel like yourself, this might be the beginning of perimenopause. It is not in your head and you don't have to navigate it alone. Understanding your hormones is the first step to taking charge of this powerful new phase of your life.